Well, I'm back again with a progress report on my uh, Jeep build here. I've got the uh, tub in inserted on, uh, interior tub inserted into the chassis and attached to the frame here. Just a uh, black primer on the bottom, some silver and gunmetal highlights. I got the interior done mostly in pink. Detailing there, a bit of uh, knobs on the, with the uh, Molotow chrome. I've got the body done. I, I ended up, uh, I think in the last video I mentioned I sprayed, uh, sanded it down a bit and sprayed it with Steinol Res uh, black primer, which left it a nice flat, uh, bl flat black, plus it was a little bit smoother. So I tried a couple of coats of the um, Craft Smart gloss black craft paint, and uh, that went on pretty well. And then I coated that with two coats of Future. Uh, floor floor shine, so uh, shined it up a bit. I managed uh, the other day to go and put all the details on the chrome trim under here, the the fender flares, headlights, and the radiator. I, I did the radiator just dry brushed some uh, brass colored uh, craft paint on that, just so it wasn't as black. It wouldn't have shown just to show the radiator inside. I got the lights in and the signal lights, the door latches, the hood latches. Uh, tail lights, license plates, things like that. I got the uh, visors painted pink, just brushed that on. So that's dry now. I'm just uh, got a few more things to put on uh, bumpers, um, spare tire, uh, just fit that into place now. I just um, get the mirrors. I still have to do the mirrors and the windshield wipers. I haven't painted the mirrors, I guess. Uh, Trying to decide what color to paint them. I'll have to prime them and I think I'm going to do them pink as well. And install those. Install the windshield wipers. They're painted up and ready to go. And then I, I, before I, the instructions say to install the uh, body on the tub there. It just fits on like that. But I wanted to get all these other things put on first. A little easier to attach all those other detail items before it's on the uh, on the chassis. So I did that and then uh, after that's uh, done, I'll get the uh, the bumpers on and the finisher up. So it's coming along pretty well, and uh, stay tuned for further updates. Well, I'm back again. I've got the uh, cheap Wrangler Rubicon kit uh, all finished up. As you can see here, I've got the decals on it, and the windshield and the sides. I've got the front and rear bumpers on. It's nice the body just... Uh, hooks over on the back. There's two tabs there hook on to the chassis. You lower it down over the uh, the frame there and then there's two little screws go in the front tighten everything together. Uh, the roll bar meets up here and this little piece goes on the top there with the uh, rear view mirror in it. Put the bumpers on. Give it a few coats of future and uh, I put some mop and shine on here. It's still a little bit shiny. Um, but that's pretty much it. Got the license plates on. I got the bottom done here. So it looks like not too much, just mostly black. A little bit of uh, gunmetal on the drive shaft and exhaust, transmission, of the blue on the uh, engine. There's no engine in it. It's a curbside, so there's no engine. It's just painted up here. And uh, there's one more piece to put on. There's the spare tire. Carrier goes on the back. This piece here, it's got the little uh, tail light attached and you're supposed to glue that on the middle right over where it says Jeep there that would get glued right on there but I thought if I had a little clip or something I could hang it on there and take it on and off so what I've done is I took a piece of sprue and a couple of pieces of um, fairly thick styrene sheet cut them into two little strips and glued a piece of sprue on top and just uh, filed it a little bit on the on the top this longer piece here that's just loose uh, and I've glued this here so what I'm going to do is glue that on the back there, glue that onto there, and then I can just hook it on there, paint it black probably, and then just hook it on, be able to take it on and off. So uh, there it is. Stay tuned for the, uh, the uh, slideshow coming up at the end.